In this video, I will show you how to create app password for your Google account. First, I will create an app password on this Google account and later, I will try that app password with the SMTP configuration on this website. Let's start. First, I'll click on the apps menu and I'll select my account settings here. I need to go to the security page. On the security page, you need to find the two-step verification option here. You can see my two-step verification is turned off. So I'll click on this and I need to turn it on before creating app specific password. So I'll click on get started. Here I need to put the password for the Google account. The sign in is now completed and here I need to put my phone number. My phone number is already here because it found my phone number on the Google account. If you don't see your phone number here, then enter your number here and scroll down and click on the next button. It will send me a text message to verify the phone number. Now I will enter the verification code here. Now I'll click on next and verify the number. The phone number verification is completed. Now I'll turn on the two-step verification. Here I can see my two-step verification is now completed. Now to create the app password, I need to open that two-step verification page again. When I scroll down and here I see the option app passwords. Currently I do not have any app passwords created. So I'll click on this. You need to put a name for the app. So I'll just put WordPress SMTP and I'll click on create. Here is the app password. So I'll copy this and I'll paste it here. Remember, you cannot view the app password again. You need to save the app password somewhere or you need to create a new password if you lost this app password. I'll click on done. That's it. Our app password is now created. Now I will try this app password with the SMTP settings on this website. For the from email, I'll copy my email address, the same Gmail address and I'll put it here. For the from name, I'll use all these settings are good and here I'll select other SMTP and the SMTP host. Since I am using the Gmail account to send the emails, I need to use the Gmail SMTP. So I'll just type smtp.gmail.com and the encryption is TLS is good. The SMTP port is 587, good and the SMTP username, I need to put the email address as the SMTP username and for the SMTP password I will use the app password here I will not use my gmail account password so I'll use this password but before using the password I need to remove the spaces between the characters so all the spaces are now removed and I'll copy it and I'll paste it here and save the settings our setup is ready now I will test the connection. So I'll go to tools here on this SMTP plugin and I'll try to send an email to this address. So I'll just click on send email. It will send an email. Here you see the test email was successfully sent. Please check your inbox. Here you see I have received the email for the SMTP test. I'll open the email and when I click on this and I can see the email has been sent from this email address and it used the same name we have put on the SMTP settings. So the SMTP connection is successful and we have tried this with the app password of the Google account. You can create multiple app passwords. Just put the app name here and click on the create button. It will display the app password and you can use it to send emails and for some other purposes. If you like the video, please hit the like button and subscribe to the channel. Thank you for watching. Thank <laughs> you.